Muggins is our most popular award-winning game and is designed to make you think. It uses addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division, along with some bluffing to accomplish that task. The object of Muggins is to get the most points. You score one point for every marble of your color on the board, but you have bonus points if you place your marbles in a run or a series like this. While you're building this run of marbles, your opponent will try to stop you by placing a marble on one side or both sides to pin you in and build his or her run instead. So your strategy in Muggins is to build a run of your own or to block someone else. To place a marble on the board, you roll three dice, pick two numbers and add, subtract, multiply or divide in any order and that gives you a subtotal. To the subtotal, you add, subtract, multiply or divide the third number giving you the answer on the board. So for example, if I were blue, I would love to make any number open beside a blue marble because it gives me bonus points. And here's how I might begin. 6 minus 3 is a 3, 3 times the 1 is a 3. This is a pretty good move because it builds bonus points for blue, but before I use that marble, I'm actually going to change the order of operations and come up with a new answer. 3 minus 1 is a 2, 2 times the 6 gives me a 12. And this is an even better move for blue because not only does it build bonus points, it also blocks the black marble. Now there are 10 or 12 answers for most rolls of the dice, but I only have one marble per turn, so I have to be very selective. When I place my answer on the board, I actually don't tell you how I made that number because it's legal to bluff if you can get away with it. If you challenge my move, I must explain how I made the number. If I cannot explain it, you've caught me bluffing, and you remove this marble plus any other marble of mine off the board, and that is my penalty for bluffing in the game. However, if I can explain my answer, I will remove one of your marbles for doubting my honesty. So in this particular combination, 6, 3, and 1, I made the 21 by saying 6 plus 1 is 7, 7 times 3 is a 21. However, I also could have made a 15, because 6 minus 1 is 5, and 5 times 3 is a 15. And even a 1 could be made, because 6 divided by 3 is a 2, and 2 minus 1 is a 1. There is a second set of dice that come with the game. They're 12-sided dice, and these are used in junior muggins. It's played the same way as regular muggins, except you're only adding and subtracting. No bluffing allowed in this version of the game. And to increase the skill even more, you can use the 12-sided dice to add, subtract, multiply, and divide your way around the board. Muggins will remain the most popular game in your home or classroom. Always fun and always a challenge, from ages 10 to nuclear physicist.